Millions of people preparing as Helene approaches Florida's Gulf Coast. Helene kicking up the surf in the Cayman Islands, now moving towards warm waters of the Gulf. Expected to quickly strengthen before making landfall along Florida's Big Bend region late Thursday as a Category 3 hurricane with 120 mile per hour winds and up to 15 feet of storm surge. At least 61 counties under a state of emergency. Florida's governor activating the National Guard. We are going to have uh, a significant impact. You still have time to make the, the preparations and put your plan in place today, but that time is, is running out. Even with landfall expected further north, high storm surge is expected from Fort Myers to Tampa due to the size of the storm. Crews there clearing drainage pipes and ditches ahead of any possible storm surge. Anything in the pipe system, manholes, inlets, we want to make sure the system is clean. So this function is close to 100% as possible. People living in low-lying areas filling up sandbags to protect against any flooding. I've seen what the storms can do, and, you know, we've been lucky for so long, so you just never know. Nearly 20,000 linemen are on standby, ready to be deployed to help restore power. Once Helene moves inland, there is concern for what the National Weather Service is calling an extremely rare event with a risk for significant and damaging flash flooding in the mountains in Georgia and the Carolinas. Those areas are already getting heavy rain right now, and this storm will just add to that. Lionel Moyes, ABC News, New York.